Not only can you build a single Instasite, you can also choose to build one Instasite template in bulk for multiple business clients. To do so, follow these steps. Select a template from the Templates tab and click Build Instasite. The first task to complete is to select a data source. The Instasite app will gather the necessary data from your business contacts from this source. You have two options. Take your business contact info directly from your contacts app or upload a CSV file. If you elect to use a CSV file, ensure that it is formatted correctly. You can check that your format is correct by comparing it to our template CSV here. This is what the template looks like. Take note of the required fields, the business name, phone, email, city, state, as well as a person's name, email, and phone. Select an option and click continue. Regardless of the data source you use, you should arrive at a new screen which features a table of your available business contacts. Instead of selecting just one contact, you can select as many as you would like. Simply check the box to the left of the name. You can edit a contact by hovering over and clicking this button, and you can add new contacts by going here and clicking New Business. After you select all of your contacts, click Continue. You will now need to choose whether or not you wish to send notifications to these contacts regarding their new website. You can send emails, SMS messages, both or none. For this demo, we will choose both. Then click Continue. You will now see a table with only the business contacts that you selected. If you have a person contact associated with the business, they will appear in the drop-down. Then you can check the box next to their name, signifying that you want to send them a notification. If there are no contacts associated, this will read 00. However, you can add new contacts for this business by hovering over and clicking this button here to create a new person contact. Then the name will appear here for you to check just like this. You can also edit pre-existing contacts by hovering over the name and clicking this button. When you're satisfied, click Continue. Next, you will create your notifications. First is your email. Select your email. Set a reply to email if necessary. Enter your subject line. And then enter your message. If you remember your personalization options, you will see that there is an Instasites category. This allows you to easily enter the person's business information. More importantly, you can select this option to automatically inject their new preview link whenever the website is available. Alternatively, you can click Use Template to select a template you made in the Templates app. If you want to attach files, click this button. Finally, you can save this email as a template by clicking this button here. Then click Continue. Repeat the process for the SMS. Select a number and enter your message. Or you can select a template. Or you can save this message as a new template. Always remember with SMS messages, you will utilize one account credit every time you exceed 160 characters. Then click Continue. Finally, you will see a summary of all of your actions. We are using three Instasite credits because we are building three websites, one for each of the three unique contacts. However, we are only notifying one contact, meaning we are only using one email credit and one SMS credit. If all of this looks correct, click continue to complete the process. Congratulations, the process was completed successfully. 
you can now click to close. Back in the My Insta Sites tab, you can see your three new websites currently being queued. You will receive a notification when these websites are built 